See if it's puck him. Tarabellum. Ah, the community here on Tribune. This dude is Max, I'm Carsten, and we present to you every week your weekly dose of classical board gaming. A tactical board game called Tribun. Uh, if you were lately into chess, then you will love Tribun. And if you are not, you will probably be in love with Tribun as well. Because we met a lot of guys around the world that said, well, chess is not so mine, but Tribun was. And we were excited and happy about this fact. The game of today is called MMA, Mixed Martial Army. And uh, I would say we jump right into the board view. Turn on the music. And um, now the mute guy begins talking. I know, shocking. But um, the game began quite uh, calm, as you, per usual. And, and one fact, right around now when you're watching this video on April 26, uh, 2024, uh, where this video is coming live, we are on an exhibition to show to the world our board game in real life. Yeah. And so, uh, games usually begin without a really crossing the uh, border in the middle mm. like you can see, uh, we touch the middle but we don't go beyond it um but that was uh, soon to change <laughs> <laughs> and about yeah. now <clears throat> yeah my first idea was to bring a lot of pieces together in one big unit as fast as possible and likewise bringing the first Sagittarius here and then I don't know I had no real game plan but going for full pressure from the first move oh and um, well uh, I was set up to counter this this uh, unit is attacked but I have quite a strong defense here so it's basically defended by five that's fine in this case you know and um, I ch chose to stick with this one for the moment. Yeah. Uh, my initial plan was to build uh, this, but uh, and that's why I built this Equus here to defend this. But currently, um, that's not really an option because um, I would just be taken, and that wouldn't be good. I I would. May I interrupt? I would have thought that you are going for this diagonal here to threaten me to pin this dude to the tribune let's find out if i contradicted this yeah and i did this is a strong threat i hate it and you do it all the time you you utilize these diagonals in this triangle here and um, yeah and so I, I won't did... get put it around. And so I actually thought about doing this, but then I thought, well, uh, let's try. Uh, let's not do this, uh, and let's instead um, kind of fortify the center. So the idea was that uh, these two are defended like this. And in the future, I would like to have a Secretarius here to defend them too. And so I, have, a, very and I rigid. have another nice job to do. They defend these diagonals to your Tribune. So these seem to be without purpose, but they are. Okay, quite simple. Just putting the plug. Yeah, see, I managed to bring all my savvy on the left flank into action. And now I'm curious what I'm going to do about these four guys here. But uh, this is an interesting thing. Um, 
this structure is uh, interesting in the sense that these two hexagons are very well protected from yeah. one, two, and three. Yeah. And uh, the interesting thing with that is that it's basically like a um, very good fortress uh, whilst also being rather cheap. Um, so I thought even of building another one in the center because uh, I assumed they would be annoying to deal with. But I didn't in the game. And at any given moment you could combine or move move this guy out of the way or combine it out of the way or something like that and you utilize this diagonal now i defended against this move by bringing this sagittarius away uh but eh, this coin has two sides you know this diagonal is yours and this is mine so well who's going to be first And I just, I, uh, f to me, this side was uh, basically done. I was like, mm. yeah, yeah, there's not going to be anything wild over there. So these are defended with six. This is with seven by yeah. these. This is defended with only three, but yeah, yeah. it's way well enough. And so. I was basically in my mind uh, disregarding this side of the board, which was okay. Uh, but your nice. focus is still on my left flank. You are now going for this one. Well, it is defended enough. Basically, these are preparation moves, I would say. Making the best use of your army so far. Uh, and interesting, I have a lot of big units. Usually I don't have. I have a lot of, a lot of savvy standing around. But this time it seems uh, like having a master plan in mind. And so you see these uh, bunch of grey hexagons. Uh, I was planning on creating an equus, say something like this, uh, to counteract this ballista. Mm hmm. Uh, which was kind of the whole point of this. And I thought, uh, I saw that this game would be drifting into me uh, basically defending. And usually I'm the attacker, so that was a little bit new to me. Yeah, because you're the belligerent one out of us. Yeah. And so I really liked uh, to see this opening. It's got I... something to do with use. You are reckless. I am old. <laughs> so, um, whilst your move opened up uh, this Equus, which I thought was uh, very annoying, that's why I blocked with this unit, uh -huh. um, it also opened up your Ballista, uh, uh -huh. which I tried to attack, so I really liked this move. Mm. So maybe going back one move, Perhaps, oops, perhaps it would have been nice to do this. You open the two of those, but not your ballista. Yeah, that's true. And I'm already setting up this. It's a triangle symmetry here. So yeah, but um, the way the game went was like this. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but I could improve. That seems strange, right? I mean, this ballista there, where can it go? All the way down? Hmm, most likely not. If you place your ballista in the next move here, then this seems to be very menacing, but it is not. The Tribune just slaps down two of the pieces, then you have an Aquis, and you have simply not enough room to make use of it. You're stuck. You, you cannot deliver the final blow. Uh, and, and suddenly you will bleed to death here. This would be interesting, though. This would be interesting, that's true. Very, but I don't very... think it would get you very far. Yeah, because I cannot split up into... 
let's say he wouldn't be there. Then this would be the nice move. This is next. Crisscross applesauce next. But yeah, please repair the board. It's not possible. So where can this blister in heaven go? I. And this was a rather stupid move. Um as it relinquishes a lot of defense. Um, the reason I did this is I was going to protect my center and I was looking to uh, use this and go here perhaps. Yeah, it would be a um, nice fork. In hindsight, I should have uh, done this instead. No, uh, like this. It protects this hexagon it attacks the ballista and it does not relinquish defense of this yeah so uh what happened in the game was so this, yeah was not really good yeah i hmm? hey yeah, yeah go forward i didn't yeah. want to interrupt you is something wrong with the replay well ah I'm okay good. you've been kicked out of the session right yep ah re-invite okay i'm taking over um see now i'm yeah, i'm taking i'm taking and why can i do that because now as you described uh, before now the defense of this is just Two. And what would happen if you take two? I would gain an Equus and I could yeah, take or rather yeah, take Impero. Just... I would not go for Impero. No, uh, but and this is threatening. You, it's, it's, it's a typical pattern. You can take two of these pieces then it's still in head status uh, and bringing down the, the Tribune. So you cannot simply take here. And that way, my ballista got closer and very, very menacing on this point. Here I have various eyes on here, on there. And so this again was uh, not that great of a move. Uh, this is not under any sort of attack. And it's also not a problem that you can go here. Uh, the real problem is this guy, and I should have defended it. Yeah. For example, one uh, very much valid move would have been this. Uh, now the defense of this is 1 and 3, so it's 4, and also you're attacking this Aquas. Yeah? Uh, would have been better than what I was going to do. Um, <laughs> And this, this way, you're attacking me, and my ballista is going for the honeypot. I'm zigzagging into your position. What, 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 what? what? At first, we were taking one step and, and describing everything, and then you had a big exchange, and we say nothing at all. Sorry. I guess it's a little too fast. Now I was zigzagging into the position. Now you take. With this Sagittarius shooting three down, I'm becoming a Sagittarius taking, and you cannot retake. Yeah, but you could, you could, but no, there is this ballista, and I would immediately strike. Yeah, so it's not immediate death. Uh, so I saw this sequence. Yeah, I, you take. Yeah. The enemy no, I take take here. And you take uh, two. You take two. And now I cannot deliver. Yes, but uh, you can go into um, into here, take three. And you cannot retake, which is very annoying, because if you would, then this would happen, and that would be yeah. Yeah. instantly knockout. And so... this is a nice pattern. You would sacrifice the Aquis. Well, not entirely, but... And so, on this, 
you basically have to, uh, you know, run away. And uh, that's just very uncomfortable, I think. And maybe this is next too. Yeah, so probably combine or something. But uh, that's beyond uh, what we are trying to do here. So It would have been next. Splitting up the center one into two has Tedai. Okay, so you went for the run right away. And I'm not a fan of combining. I, I just don't like it that much. And um, in this case, it's uh, especially important that you don't combine because you have very little space. Now mm. you can combine because now you have space. Yeah, that's very important. It's it's really annoying when you become a Sagittarius and say, whoa, now I'm safe and you suddenly realize, no, I have no place to go. Okay, this was a fork on your Tribune and on this dude, taking another material, and now I'm five points up. That's a quite comfortable position. But uh, I have at least my long uh, praised for attack on your Ballista. Yeah. Doesn't do much though, doesn't do much, you just move. But uh, now I'm a little bit closer to you. Yeah, you get a little bit of counterplay and suddenly you have a Ballista too. Now it's your file. And uh, well... Now you're basically uh, asking me a question. It's about whether I want to take this yeah. or want to be harmed. So yeah, yeah not harmed, taken entirely. Take, I have a status in your back. You get the spear and the rider in front. Bam! I did this. Yeah, you sacrificed it completely. Because I was yeah, this going to do. lose it anyways, and this unit defended this one. Yeah. And so I'm actually uh, getting compensation for it. So I have not lost a piece. Uh, yeah, you though. gained. Actually, you gained one piece. You were five down or you're four down. It was quite but a good exchange for you. Yeah, it was. Uh, and now I I went Ooh. low. Yeah, and, and see, now I'm stuck. I cannot combine, I cannot run away. Okay, he's just playing with me. He's not harming me in any way. But it feels not right. Yeah, and so I have uh, many ideas in this position. One of them, a uh, quite silly one, would be this. <laughs> uh, and uh, your response would probably be this, I suppose. And then I would try to annoy you. Yeah. So, for example, this would be yeah. a fun move to basically end you. Um, <laughs> okay, but no, let's not stray too far a path. So, uh, you took, as you had to defend against something like this, Fair enough, I just moved. And you attacked me. And I moved. <laughs> and you attacked me. <laughs> and guess what I did? I moved. <laughs> wow, what a surprise. Now, I could iterate this over and over again, but I think you get the point. I'm just being attacked, and then I, I move. Like and I'm desperate. Take a look on the clock. We are both down to 20 seconds, and it's a format where you have, uh, I don't know, 10 seconds to think about, and five, uh, five seconds you gain, or yeah, five seconds you gain uh, uh, by making a move. And so what it's I'm hard. actually quite pleased with is that your uh, troops are kind of scattered and. Um, not very well coordinated uh, so there are a lot of holes i'm able to slip through and suddenly i'm sweating here do you maybe find a way to attack me where i am i cannot run away and i would suddenly 
become next, but see, this dude is doing a very masterful job. He's defending against these two fields. You are in a Sagittarius, you could attack me from here. And you can attack me from here, but no, the Sagittarius and the Equus are providing cover. I'm, this is I'm the only field. Yeah. This is very important to me. Uh, if I miraculously beam towards it, uh, I would have won instantly. Uh, so that's ba essentially what I'm trying to achieve right there. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah, now it's not really possible now, is it? Um, and uh, basically I'm just like... Well, that was... Yeah, move, right? My fork. <laughs> Interesting though that I didn't... I don't, I don't know. know. I feel I could have done better. Something like this, perhaps. I don't know. Yeah. Doesn't really matter now, does it? You would probably do this, and well. I yeah. Would now I would run for it. We we both would be Sagittarii, and you would be a you would have a hard time hunting me down because I am up. 10, 11 points of material already. Well, I would... Oh, nope. Uh, I'm <laughs> okay. the last move to attack you with, but I I think just going here... Whoops, not like this. Going there just... And it's probably over. ...gets you out of any sort of danger, so... Yeah, not only are you down in material, but also your, your troops are scattered. You had a lot of savvy... Standing just around, not very useful, right? Yeah, and now, this is a very direct threat. Basically, uh, it's this and I win. Yeah. That didn't happen, though, sadly. I probably go for full devastation. And also freeing up my Tribune from this miserable position here in the corner. <laughs> and now I think, okay, sandbox mode is over, pal. Yeah, and so I just uh, try to centralize my things. Uh, maybe you are wondering, happen. sorry, uh, could you please step back one for all of the audience who may think, hey, what's about taking here? Well, no, because I could counteract this. That's why you like usually... Uh, you never right. attack uh, a ballista with a Sagittarius, and you usually not attack uh, with an Equus at Centuria because uh, the mirroring unit would emerge. Well, don't don't attack anything that is twice your height. Yeah, is well, the metaphor. Um, so, <laughs> so I just moved out of the way, and you attacked me. And I think I uh, messed up. Yeah, I did this. Yeah. I looked at it, and I, uh, my thought process was like this. We have the Aquas. The Aquas blocks these two hexagons here. Then we have the Ballista. The Ballista blocks this and this hexagon. The Aquas um, also yeah. blocks the own hexagon. As I cannot take it, I can only harm it, and even if I could take it, it's defended. The Aquas also defends this hexagon. This is protected by this and this. Yeah. This is uh, protected by the same two units. Yeah. This... I can't go here because of this. This is, uh, again, not an option, and this is also defended. Yeah. And this is also defended by the two of those. Next in the center. So that's what I thought, but uh, actually I could have taken. I just <laughs> didn't bother thinking about it. Wouldn't have made a big difference anyway, so you would probably have done this. Yeah. Could then have moved, I don't know, here for example, you take here. And, and it, then you take with this Sagittarius 3 again, now you are up so much material, so many pieces, and you will simply win this. Even I would win it, 
with 30 seconds on the clock. Yeah, and even if you did not take... Uh, I would. No. You can always go and attack me further. Like this. That's mm -hmm. always an option, and then I have to scramble around. And then I don't have a lot of options, and so that would also be losing. So yeah. it wasn't like that terrible. It just, uh, you know, sped up the game. Yeah, and it was a proof that a mixed martial army is really good. Even under the, my command. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So yeah, I would sure. say back on the goodbye screen. Yeah, so we hope you enjoyed this game or this game. This game, uh, in terms of uh, the way we played, or the game in terms of uh, the game tr Tribune. So, uh, of course. The game in and of itself. Um, so if that was the case, either one, uh, it then... It was. <laughs> it's not a question. Then hit the like, uh, subscribe, bell. I think there's like a bell icon when you subscribe, you can hit that too. You can share the video with your friends uh, or other people, strangers on the internet. We don't really care. <laughs> and... Um, well, I think that's it. We have a website, trimun.org, um, and we're working on a third-party, basically, uh, game, so that you don't need the tabletop simulator. Mm. And uh, all files you need are in the description. And until yeah. then, I I'm not say... really sure. Maybe, maybe the file or the links, not directly, I guess, uh, for the new videos, I put the link to www.tribune.org down there. And from our official website, you can download all the necessary stuff from the download section. Yeah, okay. Fair enough. It's, it's quite the same, but uh, maybe people get lost and complain about, uh, I didn't find it. And so, uh, we, we um, maybe we see us on the... Uh... Exhibition? Yeah, and and, exhibition um, in Dortmund. And until then, I would say, see you soon. On Tribune.